do 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 do. Hello, everybody, and welcome to SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom. I'm sure some of you guys have heard of this game before. It's pretty old, as you can see. It's an old THQ game. And uh, if you guys are excited for this, let's play. Throw a thumbs up on this video because we are about to get right into this, baby. Welcome to Bikini Bottom, a normally peaceful undersea sanctuary. Today, it will be transformed into a theater of pure horror. It's so beautiful, we'll though. Yellow friend will play the starring role. Oh, no, Plankton, what are you doing? Is the big day. I have what is this guy doing? Plan to finally steal the Krabby Patty formula. Well, we know that. The bottom happens to get demolished in the process. Oh, well. <laughs> With my brand new Duplicatotron 3000, I'll clone an army of robots that will wreak mayhem Duplicatotron. and at my command! One last review of the checklist. Let's see. Item number one, is Plankton a genius? Answer, yes! Okay, checklist complete. Throw at the switch! Ooh, I don't think he met he didn't put the other switch. No, no, no. I want to get a photo for my scrap. Oh. Hey, hello. What do you think you're doing? Oh no, no, no. Wait. Wait. But I'm your master. I made you. No. No. Oh, my good China. My good China. Nah, sorry, that China's done, bro. You should put it in the cabinet, see, you messed up. Oh, SpongeBob chilling. Perfect day playing robots and racehorses. Yeah. Sounds like an interesting game. Getting the racehorses and the robots mixed up. Wouldn't it be great if we had real robots to play with, Patrick? I'd name mine Robo Jr. or Zorlon. Or maybe <gasps> Zoltan! Yeah, these unreal robots are getting boring. Hey, what if we put the robots in here? Oh, how Ooh, sharp okay. is okay. you? Okay, okay. I'm liking this plan. It's not just any shell. It's my magic wishing shell. Wow, that's great, Patrick. Yo, I didn't know that. So we put the toy robots in here. Okay. Okay. Then we say the magic wishing words and shake the magic wishing shell. Okay. okay. Then we go to sleep, and in the morning, we'll have real robots to play with. I like it. But Patrick, aren't we going to say the magic wishing words? You already did. So, okay is the magic <laughs> wishing word? It used to be Alakazama Alabala Wisna Tikitana Fushbar Griddle Bits Von Schnauzer, but I kept forgetting it. Are you sure this will work? <laughs> sure. <laughs> Who's man? I had one big cookie crumb and I was really hungry. So I put my cookie crumb in the magic wishing shell. Then I said the magic wishing word and shook it. And in the morning, I had lots of little cookie crumbs. Patrick, mm. I proclaim that tomorrow is going to be the best. I mean, you can't fight with results like that. Good night, SpongeBob. Good night, Patrick. The next morning. <laughs> Gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with... Wow! What the hell? Uh, Gary, did you do that? <laughs> Your bikini bottom stinks. Got him. Let's see what's going yeah, down, Gary. baby. It sure looks like we're in a doozy of a pickle. I think I'm gonna have to learn a lot in order to fix this mess. Meow! <laughs> What a fantastic idea! These signs will provide important tips to help me out! So I need to go by all the signs, uh, huh? How do I read the signs? I don't know. <laughs> oh, okay! <laughs> Press this button to read the signs. R1, okay. So if I want to come back and talk to you again, just walk up to you and press this button! I'd better get started now, Gary. I think that this is going to be a very long day. Explore the rest of SpongeBob's house. Ooh, ooh. Okay, we're going everywhere in here. Okay, so this door is locked. You will need 50 shiny objects in order to open it. Okay, so we need 50 shiny objects. Oh, SpongeBob's got the jump school. Oh my god! Who said sponges can't jump? My man's really out here getting it. Oh. I make myself a note from Mr. Krabs. And it even smells sweaty, just like him. 
Ahoy there, SpongeBob! As a faithful crew member of the Krusty Krab, you've been er that, promoted. That's like kind of Mr. Krabs. Object collector. <laughs> that's Mr. Krabs if it was spelled like actual crabs. This ain't this ain't crabs with a K. I don't know who this man is. Wow! A promotion! That's right! A promotion! So what this here new job entails is you collecting all these shiny objects that the robots are leaving behind and bringing them to me. Now stop seahorsing around and get busy collecting. Ooh, we playing Spyro now, boys. Shines. Gimme, gimme. I mean, look at this. I can basically touch the ceiling. SpongeBob is really out here getting it. 48, there's gotta be more in this room that I didn't see. Or maybe there's, hello? Oh, that was okay. So I think that was telling me about the camera. It looked like I saw I saw analog sticks. So I think that that sign was telling me about the camera. Okay, what? Okay. Oh, okay. There we go. Hello. Oh, well, there's fifty of my points. This is a golden spatula. Golden spatulas are needed to unlock new areas of Bikini Bottom. SpongeBob will need to collect many golden spatulas in order to find and defeat the source of the rampaging robots. Woo! I'm a millionaire, baby! Golden spatula god! So we got our first golden spatula. I think we have enough points to do this too, so... Let's head on in! Maybe a little bounce on the old bed. This is a pair of SpongeBob's underwear. SpongeBob will lose a pair of underwear every time he gets hit by a robot or touches dangerous objects or surfaces. <sighs> Okay. Once SpongeBob has lost all his underwear, he must start that area over again. SpongeBob may get back his underwear he has lost by collecting additional pairs along the way. SpongeBob starts out by wearing three pairs of underwear, but there are special pairs of golden underwear hidden in a bikini bottom, which if found will allow SpongeBob to wear more than three pairs. SpongeBob can check how many pairs of underwear he has on by pressing the R2 button. Okay, so that brings up the HUD. We playing Crash even if we ain't playing Crash. Yo, Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy! <laughs> They're my heroes, Shunch. Spongebob may jump by pressing the X button. Pressing the X button while Spongebob is in mid-jump will cause him to double jump for extra height, but Spongebob can only double jump once per jump. Okay. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Well, we just got 20. Sandy cheeks! Oh, there's a lot of signs in here. Okay. Spongebob may see how well he is doing by pressing the R2 button. The number in the upper right-hand corner is how many shiny objects Spongebob has. The number in the upper center is how many golden spatulas he's collected. And the number in the lower right is how many of Patrick's lost socks Spongebob has found. And finally, the number in the upper left is how many pairs of underwear Spongebob has. Well, there you go. We haven't found any of the socks. Press the square button and Spongebob will do a bubble... S Yo, we are really playing Crash. Spongebob may use the bubble spin to smash open tiki's. Push buttons on walls or defeat most robots. SpongeBob may also bubble spin in mid jump to hit things that are higher up. Ooh, 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 combo boys, ooh, combos! <laughs> we really out here getting it, man. Boop. Oh my, okay. We unlocking more little shiny objects. Let's see, what else we got? Press the circle button in midair and SpongeBob will do a bubble bounce. The bubble bounce attack can smash tiki's or robots that are directly below SpongeBob or push buttons on the ground. SpongeBob may only do the bubble ju uh, Okay, thought that was a comma. SpongeBob may only do the bubble bounce move during a jump. Oh! Tell me SpongeBob got the cheeks! Well, I'll be darned. Oh my! Uh, uh, hit the double jump! One more time! Oh, money! Press the triangle button when on the ground and SpongeBob will do a bubble bash attack. The bubble bash attack can smash tiki's or robots or push buttons that are directly above SpongeBob. When you see this icon, SpongeBob can stand on it and bubble bash to break tiki's directly above him. Okay. Only puts on a little helmet. That's pretty cool. What does this do? Oh, my. Beach ball mania. Come on, let me on the ball. Oh, nice. So we have 64 shiny objects. I think that's, wait, what is this? To see how well SpongeBob is doing in every level of the game, press the start button. When paused, pressing up and down will show you how well SpongeBob is doing at each level of the game. 
Pressing right and left will give SpongeBob a hint on each golden spatula that SpongeBob knows about. By pressing the X button when the hint for a golden spatula is selected, SpongeBob can take a taxi directly to that area of that spatula from anywhere in the game. Yo, hold on. Oh, we gotta get the ball over here. Oh, there's a sock! Oh no, there's a timer! What the? What? How do I get over there? What? Oh no. No, 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 no. This ain't how we, we ain't going out like that. Me and Spongebob, we ain't going out like that. All right, ball, 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 ball. Come back. Yeah, 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 go over here. Yeah, 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 right there. No, ball, ball, no. Ah! Okay, right, hey, hey. No, no. No! He's not listening to me. You must listen to me, we must work together. Spongebob. Come, no! If you don't get back over here. Come on. And perfect. There we go. Okay. Maybe we can maybe we can climb on this. No! Um, I'm, 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 hold, time out, time, time out, time out, time out, time out, time out, time out. The ball just keeps rolling. Time out. Oh, clamber, clamber. No! We're getting this. All right, SpongeBob. Third time's a charm. You know what they say. No, SpongeBob. We gotta get the dirty sock. SpongeBob! This ball. Okay. Okay. I don't think we can do anything else with the ball. I think. Perfect. Now let's get out of here. We got other things to do. SpongeBob stuff. Let's pay up the golden spatula and enter Bikini Bottom. What's going on out here? It's probably robots destroying everything. Ah, uh, there was nothing like the sound. Yo, there's uh, Mr. Krabs with the sea. Go away, SpongeBob. You're polluting my thinking space. <laughs> You're on my property, bub. Trying to steal the Krabby Patty formula again, eh, Plankton? Well, you won't get away with it. I've got bigger fish to fry. I've got to figure out how to regain control of the chum bucket from those robots. Where did they come from? Where? Um, I don't know. Not for me, though, that's for sure. They just showed up out of nowhere and started calling me rude names and throwing things. Ooh, rascals. They even bent all my spoons. I love those spoons like they were my children. I hear you, ma'am. That's terrible. Oh, won't you help me stop them? Before they bend all my forks? Not the forks! <laughs> of course I'll help. But wait, I'm supposed to collect a whole lot of golden spatulas. Golden spatulas, eh? SpongeBob, if you could get me back into the chum bucket, I'll give you a bucket full of golden spatulas. Oh, okay. In your dreams. You've got a deal. I ain't helping you do nothing right now, my guy. Yo, they look at me and turn? It shines. Woo! Oh, no, I made a mistake. I made a mistake. Peace, bubble buddy. Bubble buddy! You see, you're going to need to learn some new bubble blowing moves if you're going to journey to the ninth dimension and defeat the giant monkey man. But, uh, all I need to do is figure out how to get rid of these robots. Oh, yeah, <laughs> sorry. I've been in the soap bottle a little too long. Yeah, you're not kidding. Where were we? Uh, something about new bubble moves. 
Right! Press this button and you'll launch yourself straight up in the air with bubble power that defeats anything that is direct. Oh yeah, I already got that part, bubble buddy. Thank you though. I put respect on your name. Look at me doing it, Bubble Buddy. We're really doing it. Gotta okay, get these shiny parts. There's some underwear over here, but I'm full of underwear right now, so. We gotta find the special underwear. 15 golden spatulas? Holy moly, what do these do? Oh, I think I just. I think I just killed a jellyfish. <laughs> hey, Patrick! Hey, Patrick. Nice sock. What sock? The one you're standing on. Oh, that one. It's lost. Well, if that one's lost, where are your other socks? Well, they're more lost. A bunch of robots came through here and stole my whole sock collection. I could use some help getting them back. I could try. Sure thing, Patrick. What are best friends for? Okay, then. For every ten socks you bring back to me, I'll give you a golden turkey baster. You mean spatula? Bless you. <laughs> this man's out of control. All right, so we have two of them right now, so that's pretty good. Woo! Ten golden spatulas? Gula goo? Oh my goodness, is this an atomic bomb? What in the world? The bubble bounce? Oh, so I can go on top of uh, Squidward's house. Okay. Combo boys. Oh, there's a golden spatula from Squidward's house. Oh, to my house. Oh, no. Fam, I ain't asked for this. It's got a... Where is it at? Oh no! Go, go, go! Quicker, quicker! What? Oh, oh! <gasps> it's golden underwear! Well, how the heck do I get it? Oh! Woo! Spatula boys! So we got three of them. Oh, two of them, my bad. Can't even count. Sorry, I counted the sock as one. Can I? Okay. Hey, jellyfish. Yeah. Well, I could get that if I needed it. Five golden spatulas for this one. SpongeBob, this flapping robot crisis is making the Krusty Krab lose money like a sinking ship. No money means no more Krusty Krab. No more Krusty Krab means no more fry cooking for you. You're not even my real boss. Who are you? <laughs> But because you're gullible, I'm going to help you out. And of course, make a small profit in return. A very small one. I've got a few golden spatulas that I'll be willing to trade to you for some of those shiny objects. Well, perfect. You will? Of course. What are employers for? Besides, them shiny objects is worth lots of money. Your treasure chest's looking a bit light, boy. Do you think I've got bilge water on the brain? I ain't running a charity here. Come back when you've got enough shiny objects. 3,000 shiny objects? What, you think I made of money, my guy? Okay. 3,000. That's a lot. We only have 189 right now, and I think we picked up all the shiny objects except for these right here. <gasps> money team. That's me sliding into your DMs. Well, let's check out with this jellyfish fields, I guess. Sure. Uh, I don't even know. That man rode through ah, no roads the to get there. Green hills of jellyfish fields, a place to experience nature at its most raw. This is a pretty big level. Sometimes a bit tender from the stings. And we gotta get all the way. Oh! <laughs> don't taste my butt. Are they really going to guard him? 
We gotta go help him. Squidward, we're coming. Ow! Squidward, are you okay? No, I'm not okay, you barnacle head. Do I look like I'm okay? Well, your nose does look pretty big. I mean, bigger than usual because it's Jeez, going for the big. neck. And you look clammy. And oh my gosh, you're bald! <laughs> I've always been bald. You're bald! I'm stung all over. Well, according to the Jellyfisher Field Manual, severe jellyfish stings can be treated effectively by applying a thick layer of King Jellyfish Jelly to the affected areas. <laughs> King j j jellyfish Well, I guess you're off to scale Spork Mountain and die a horrible death under the vicious tentacles of King Jellyfish. <laughs> oh my. I'll stay here. Bald up here in excruciating pain. You do that! Don't <gasps> worry, Squidward! I'll bring back that King Jellyfish <gasps> jelly for you to rub all over yourself. Alright, so now we got a couple of objectives to do. Well, first, let me get these tiki's because I gotta get three thousand of these things just to trade in to Mr. Krabs. Wait, was there a robot over here? What you gonna do, boy? <laughs> what you gonna do, boy? Oh, jellyfish. I wonder if I can get like a net and catch them. This is goo. SpongeBob and Patrick can't swim, so don't let them fall in the goo. Okay, so, but can Squidward swim? That's the big question here, because there's a sock over there that I kind of want. This is a teleport box. When you have both of the teleport boxes in the area open, you may teleport between them by jumping inside. Oh, nice. Let's go ahead and open that so we can get that. So I guess when we, I guess when we fix Squidward's nose and his male pattern baldness, we can uh, use them to get in the goo. I'm guessing maybe. You can't jellyfish today. I'm going fishing for robots. Whoa. Two robots! We get a lot of shiny objects when we kill those robots. That's what's up. Come here, Tiki boys. Super Ultra Combo! What is this? Oh, someone TP'd this little tree. Hey, jellyfish. Uh-oh! My man, he's zoning me! He's zoning me! <laughs> Had to put him down gently. Goodness gracious. Ultra combo. Let's keep it moving. SpongeBob's on the prowl. Oh, we can... Ooh, this is dangerous, but, uh... What can I say? I'm a dangerous man. Woo! Just for that, dude. Whoa! Yeah, I'm gonna do that instead. 125 to open this clam. Do I want to do that? That's a lot. That's a light. That's a lot right off the head, you know. Oh, what's this down here? Um. Okay. <laughs> There's got to be some mechanic that I haven't seen yet. If you don't get out of here. Okay. Oh my, a secret cave! Super monster, super monster combo! And I got a sock. Oh, you can go up there. How do I get up there? Can I keep going? I swear it looks like you can keep going and walk up there. Yeah, I might need another character for that. We're gonna see. We'll see if we'll get Squidward unlocked. See what's going down. Cause I don't think there's anything. At least maybe there's another area over there. Do you want to feed the clam 125 shiny objects to complete the bridge? Well, I guess I have to. Dropping the load. <laughs> All right, let's get it. This is a checkpoint. Oh, we're gonna need those. If you are defeated after activating a checkpoint, you are restarted the checkpoint. So the beginning of the area. Well, that's good. Are you coming for me? Whoop! Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Ah, bah! <laughs> I'll break that up if I got to. I'll take that underwear, thank you. Feel like a new sponge. Give me this. What is this? 
tartar sauce. Oh, there's something over here. Hey, what's up, robot boy? Whippee! Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I barely missed you, you big jerk. This is freezy fruit. Only Patrick can use the freezy fruit. Okay, well, I, you didn't even tell me what it was, but okay. Yeah, I could defeat the hovering tiki's, but I also want to jump on top of them because I feel like I saw something. Ooh, that's right. Wah! That didn't work. Oh, come back. There we go. I wish it would have told me what the freezy fruit does. Woo! Woo! Oh no, should I have kept one so I could have jumped on that platform? I assumed I could get to that platform just by jumping. Oh my, I almost... What? Secret tiki's? There's secret stuff all over this game. Uh oh. <laughs> I love when they die, it sounds like the, you're, they're like pooting. <laughs> Woo, and you miss, boy, get zoned. <laughs> Playing these dudes like fiddles. Touche. I think that's it for this part that I could get. Let's head over here. Can I jump? Oh, clamber, boys. Oh, I still don't know if I can make that jump. No, but I can maybe use these tiki's. Nice. Oh, <gasps> perfect. Oh, there's a sock over here. No. <gasps> Oh, she didn't make it, boys. I'll take that sock. Oh, and we got a super rare one over here. How much is it worth? We'll see. We're at 464. Woo! And it sends us right back over here. That's perfection. Oh, darn it. Maybe I can just... There you go. Clamber, SpongeBob. Clamber. There we go, combo boys. Hello? Um, whom? Schwein whom? <laughs> Who is this? Let's, uh, let's stay over there, puffer boy. What am I supposed to do against this? Okay, so I need to, like, go to the right. <laughs> oh! <laughs> We're good. Who is shooting these things? Can I stop them from shooting? Yes, I can. I just destroy the whole thing with a uh, bubble wand. I don't even know how I did that. Hey, Gary, what's shaking? Okay, okay. Yeah, true, true, true. Oh. <gasps> wow, a bungee jump for a golden spatula. I must be in heaven. Oh, nice. So that's... Okay, so that's the mechanic that we were looking for earlier. Because I had no idea. I was like, how do I even do this? Well, let's head over there and see what's going down. This is a bungee hook. Well, not kind of. SpongeBob can bungee from it. To bungee from the bungee hook, just jump up and touch it. To dive downward, press the X button. To exit the bungee hook, press the triangle button. Does this look dangerous to you? I think we got it all. Let's quit. Woo! And we got another spatula, baby. We need to think, I think we need to get at least five in this level, right? I think it's five. So, because uh, that was the next part that I saw on Bikini Bottom. Sometimes pushing a simple button is the most satisfying. Push, push, True that. Push, push. True that, SpongeBob. True words have never been spoken. Hey, Mr. Robot. Heka! <laughs> See, he sounds like he's Putin. Poop. Checkpoint, boys. Yo, what? This man's got a big ham hammer?
I want to go near him. Okay, so I just need to... Whoa, now, big boy! Just slow that roll. Yeah! Can I, can I steal the ham? Can I can I take that with me? No. Hey, you good, man? You Are we friends? Or are you... Are we not friends? Are we friends? <laughs> I can't tell. Can't, oh, there's more ham robots? Boy, you better go on! Woo! And I zoned ya. They call me the young zone god. Really out here getting it. Uh, I guess we could check over here. I'm surprised you don't get hurt from the boxes crumbling down on you. Hey, Mr. Rope. Woo! And I zoned you again, boy. I love that, that you can do that. That's awesome. Can I jump up here? Oh, that just leads me back over there. I thought I saw something. I guess not. Okay. All right, so how can we do this? Oh. It shines. And you can't grab one of those trees. There we go. Maybe we can, yeah, I think if we get up on that cliff, we might be able to do it. So let's go around this side. That ham robot's over here. Hey! Yeah! <laughs> Got all of them. Yeah, I think the cliff over. Oh, nice. We might actually. We actually getting a ton of uh, ton of shiny objects from this level. You know that. What is going on here, boys? <gasps> what? I'm getting a little more used to the camera now. This is goo. SpongeBob and Patrick can't swim, so don't let them fall in the goo. Oh, you thought. Okay. My man committed Sudoku. That's cool. Oh, we got two kinds of robots out here. What's up, boys? Woo! Oh, that didn't work at all. At all. I got double slam dunked. Do I risk it all for the biscuit? Team, I'm not gonna be able to destroy those though. Nah, you good. Zoning all you robots. That's my job. Oh, I see a sock up there. But this is calling my name right now. Woo! Holy moly! It's truly lit. Oh, there's another one. Oh! <laughs> well, that didn't turn out anything like I expected it to. Woo! Get that money, SpongeBob. Get that money. Is that it? Oh! Where are we going? Oh! <gasps> There was a sock? I didn't even know that. Woo! I was just getting the, the shiny objects. That worked out great, except for, you know, the goo thing happened. What in the world? Wow, they got so much of this is from Crash. I love it. I love the inspiration, John. That machine huffing and puffing over there is a duplication Tron 1000. The D1000 will continue to create robots until it is destroyed. Be careful, though. It goes without a big bang. Maybe it's because I'm also playing Crash right now, so the same mechanics being in the game, I really like, because now I don't have to learn, like, something, like, too new. Move. Oh, whoa, I didn't even see you. Where did... Okay. My oh, man somehow survived. I don't even... Spatula boys. Is that number five? Push, 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 push. Four. Shoot. Did we miss one? Because we definitely don't have 3,000. Oh, the jellyfish caves, huh? 
Oh, let me look. Let me look over the wide horizons of jellyfish fields before we head on to the next part. Oh, and I can grab me a uh, underwear. I th okay, there was a robot down there. I don't even know what he was doing. All right, let's move on. Let's move her to lose it, baby, to the jellyfish caves. Let's see what's going on there. Wow, mermaid man! I have all your comics and toys and mail. Hey, huh? W what? Oh, yeah, it's that sponge kid. And now, what was I supposed to tell you? You're not Mermaid Man. Who are you? Patrick is surrounded by robots and needs my help. Huh? Oh, no. I think it had something to do with massaging my feet. Well, if massaging your feet will save Patrick, then massage I must. Help! They're making me hit myself! Massaging your feet isn't working. I think I'd better try a more direct approach. By clipping my toenails? Here I come, Patrick! Let's open this up. This is a slide. When SpongeBob, Patrick, or Sandy jump onto a slide, they will zip down the slide at hydrodynamic speeds! Okay. Well, one second, Patrick. I'll be over there in just a second. Let me make sure I got everything here. All right, Mermaid Man, it was good talking to you. Whenever you're not possessed by some other human being, you tell me. Whee! Oh! It's so extreme! <gasps> Woo! Holy moly! That was a ton of fun. Goodness I gracious. I could do it again right now, I guess. Because I saw something up there. I guess if I... Let's try it again. I'm back. Let's do this. Oh! <laughs> All right, one more time. Third time's the charm here. We'll get it. It's sort of difficult to control SpongeBob. I mean, my man's really getting it out here. All right, let's get that one we missed. Well, we could go over there, too. Oh, I didn't get that one. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Darn it. I didn't jump off the thing. Fourth time is a charm. Let's try to hit that thing on the side here, too. Oh! Yo, we took an alternative route and I didn't hit any of the crates. Oh, well, I hit some of them. Oh, there's a sock over here! Whoa! And I got this other sock! Okay! Told you, four times the genre. This is, you know, how things go around here. And we got ourselves a little checkpoint action. And now... Oh, we gotta destroy a couple of these. We're coming, Patrick. Woo, clamber. How did I get hurt? From what? Well, good thing there is a. Uh, I think. I think from the machine exploding, I got hurt. I feel like a new sponge. Woo, zones, but ow! I got him. Zoning is my specialty. Okay. I hit it. Oh, darn it. I keep getting hit. I gotta run away once I hit it. Thank goodness there's more underwear, though. Hey, boys. Okay. Now we must go this way. I should be good. Okay. Perfect. I think I hit all three, which opens up 
the ninth gate of hell. <laughs> or just the bridge to Patrick, one of those two. Hello? Hello? Hey, buddy! Hey, SpongeBob! Woo! Thank goodness you're safe, Patrick. Well, of course, SpongeBob. Why wouldn't I be? I don't know. Well, the robots and the... Oh, yeah, I found this for you. I don't know what it is, but it's... My so man! Good. Thanks, Patrick. I tell you what, all that running around has left me pooped. Why don't you continue on for a bit? Okay. Let's go, baby! Give me that spatula, baby. Now let's continue. This is a throw fruit. Patrick can pick up throw fruit and throw it. Throw fruit will push buttons, destroy tiki's, or destroy damage robots. But use it quickly because it will wilt. Okay, so what do I need to? I need to hit this button. Let me read that again. How do I pick it up? Okay. <laughs> do I get... Okay, I thought I said, do I get another chance, or... Woo! Okay, so circle... Okay, that makes sense. Patrick can also pick up and throw tiki's, but only tiki's that don't have other tiki's stacked on top of them. Okay. All right, so we can... This is a bus stop. You may switch between playing SpongeBob or playing Patrick at bus stops. Okay. So we can pick this up. That would have old man Jenkins here. God! Patrick can throw fruit up steps and then climb the steps, pick up the fruit, and throw it again. But he better hurry before it wilts. Okay, um, yeah, that's the bus stop. <gasps> no, I didn't see these over here. I would have thrown more at them. Well, I guess I could technically... Whoop! And then just wait for the fruit to come back. Whoop! What? Patrick! How are you gonna play with the Astros with aim like that? There we go. Look at that. I'm telling you that aim. Okay, this is a special Patrick teeter-totter that only Patrick can use. Have Patrick pick up a throw fruit, stand on the pink starfish side, then throw the fruit at the target side. Patrick will then... F okay, so... Woo! Woo! <laughs> Checkpoint, boys. Hey, jellyfish. This is a thunder tiki. When Patrick touches it, it will begin to storm, and after a few seconds, we'll go boom. Don't be near it when it goes boom. Okay. Touches it. Okay. That was, you know what? Reading is uh, an interesting thing. Patrick can pick up a thunder tiki and throw it just like other tikis, but he had better throw it fast. Okay. Well. Yeah, I'll throw it at old man Jenkins here. Hey, what's up, buddy? Hey, you barnacle head! Watch where you're going! The rock is talking to me. <laughs> Dwayne Johnson? Oh, mighty rock! I am at your command! Down here, you big pink lummox! Oh, hi there, Mr. Plankton. Are you going to vaporize me today? So very tempting. Unfortunately, I found myself in the undesirable position of having to assist you. I was in an undesirable position yesterday, and now my neck hurts. Heed my words, oh my. my large future minion. Go into Jellyfish Cave. Follow the instructions on the signs that you see. At the end of the caves, you'll still be a big pink idiot, but you'll know enough to help defeat the robots and get me back into the chum bucket. Well, then will you vaporize me? 
I might spare your life so I can force you to work in my sweatshop, making oh my design and knock off wallets. Oh, thank you. That's not my wallet, though. If you jump in the air and press a circle button, Patrick will slam down to the ground, damaging tiki's or doing other stuff that Patrick does. Whoop! Whoop! Yeah! It's me, it's me. Oh, I thought that was... Oh, my. Oh, they explode into a million pieces! Okay, we got some fruit action here. Remember, Patrick can throw a fruit, and then pick it up and throw it again. Um, well, Patrick gotta hit the... Patrick, you gotta... <laughs> you got it, man. I believe in you. Look, hit the... Okay, there you go. No. Patrick, you got... You got it, Patrick. We all believe in you here, buddy. We're on your side. Woo! How we get up there? Can he clamber? Perfect, he can. What can I throw this at? Yeah, throw it at the... Yeah! That totally worked. Okay, now I'm gonna pick this up too. No! Patrick, come on, buddy. You just gotta go over here. Yep. Perfect. 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 Yeah, there you go. Get that. Get that money, baby. Oh my. Okay. Okay, so. Perfect. Can I pick these things up with Patrick? I wonder. Let's try. No. No, no, you can't. Okay. I'm not... Oh, okay. So, do we have to carry this across the entire platform? Well, if we did, we ain't now. I guess as if we wanted those tiki's. Checkpoint. Oh my. Oh, I just took a. I didn't see that. Now, I'm gonna need me some of these underwears. Thank you. I will take this. No, wrong one! Thunder Tiki. Perfect. The weight of throw fruit will also activate. Okay. Well, oh, time out, time out, time out, time out, time out. We gotta. There we go. That didn't work at all. I right, will just put it there. Forget that. Patrick can also jump up on throw fruits to get to higher places. He may stack throw fruit as well by throwing a throw fruit on top of another throw fruit. Oh my. Oop. What if I did this? That didn't work. Pick that up. Patrick. Yep. Throw it up there. Clamber! Okay, this is where we gotta use double throw fruit.
Woo! Uh-oh, we sliding now, boys. Coward freaking bunga, my guy. Woo! Woo, this is a little difficult. This is definitely more, oh lord, do not hit the thunder ones, okay. This is a freezy fruit. Patrick can pick up freezy fruit and throw it. Freezy fruit will temporarily freeze goo. Oh, nice. And I can slide on it. Okay. I have to remember that. Hey, what's up, little kid? What are you doing here? What's up, loser? <laughs> okay, so... I guess we're going to have to... Well, not really. If Patrick belly flops near robots, he can damage or stun them. Small ro robots will just be defeated. Larger robots will be stunned. Okay. We'll try it. What's up, little boys? Oh, that didn't work. Ultra combo. I'm gonna need them underwear. He can throw fruits to defeat robots. Well, Patrick's OP, huh? Okay. That was interesting, Patrick. Why don't you go ahead and grab that, my, my guy, and we'll go ahead and uh, toss that up there. Ooh, I got two for one combo. Woo, big boy, you ain't gonna rush me. Patrick may even pick up robots he has stunned and throw them into other robots. Did I stun him? Did I not get close enough? Nice. Okay, so Patrick's OP. Oh, I should have thrown. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. No! You damn jerk. There we go. Okay. I will take that all day, baby. Oh, there's a sock over there. So, yeah, we're going to go do the freezy fruit thing. I didn't even see that sock. So, let's go back down here and do this freezy fruit thing. Get our underwear. <laughs> Probably shouldn't, but <laughs> whatever. All right, little men. Excuse me while I go do my thing. Oh, we got... Okay, so it gives you a little timer. That's nice. I thought it wouldn't. It would just give you, like, a cue. I was like, ooh. <gasps> there was a purple one! I missed it down there! Oh, man. <sighs> worth. <laughs> totally worth. We gotta go back to the beginning. Here we go. I totally miss this little sucker back here. Carry a lot of stuff around. Now let's go back over here, 2,500. Young Patrick swagging. And we will go back to the lake. Tells me you're looking for the king jellyfish. Kind of. Yes. Good thing too. That monster has been stinging all my good customers in their poop decks. I hear that you can find him up top of Old Sport Mountain here. Go hook that beast, sailor. Holy moly! Oh boy, Mr. Krabs, I'll see what I can do. Woo, that's way up there. All right, guys, I think that's a good place to end it for this episode. I hope that you guys did enjoy it. Remember, if you did, leave that thumbs up. Subscribe if you guys are not subscribed for more of that goodness on my channel. And I'll see you guys next time. See you.